This is a 3D scan of a Drosophila melanogaster, aka a fruit fly. And it allows us to see with exquisite detail just how jacked fruit flies are. All of these white fibers that you see running along the back of the fly are all muscle. Specifically, these are the muscles that control flight. There are two groups of muscles at play here. These right here in the middle that you see running from the front to the back of the fly are the dorsolongitudinal muscles. And then these along the side going up and down are the dorsoventral muscles. Here's another look at those dorsoventral muscles and dorsolongitudinal muscles. When flies fly, first these muscles on the side contract to cause the wings to elevate. And then these muscles along the center contract causing the wings to depress. And here's what that looks like put into practice. But what's most incredible about this is that when they fly, they flap their wings 200 times per second which means that these two sets of muscles have to contract 200 times per second to enable flight. That is pretty incredible, and will definitely make me think twice about squishing or swatting them. I guess it's not that surprising that so much of their body is devoted to these muscles, because flight is so important to their survival. After all, what is a fly without flight? A sit?